Okay, so this is MC Squared Coaching Center and this is part 12 of our mathematics lecture para po sa civil service exam. Okay, so this is mathematics na lecture po natin. So the, the questions na nandito po, yun po yung mga frequently asked questions. Good day, I'm Engineer Melvin Jan Habla Bansuelo, CIS. Okay, so this is problem number one. If 6 plus 7 plus 8 plus 9 plus 10 equals 40, then 16 plus 17 plus 18 plus 9 plus 20 equals to blank. So, paano ba na form itong 16? So, 6 plus 10, that is 16. 7 plus 10, that is 17. 8 plus 10, that is 18. 9 plus 10, that is 19. 10 plus 10, that is 20. So, since given na siya, yung 6 plus 7 plus 8 plus 9 plus 10, that is 40, kukunin na lang natin yung additional nila. So, 10 plus 10 plus 10 plus 10 plus 10. So, that is limang 10, 10 times 5, that is 50. So, para makuha natin yung 16 plus 17 plus 18 plus 19 plus 20, and given naman itong 6 plus 7 plus 8 plus 9 plus 10 equals to 40. So, we add na lang natin 50 plus 40 and that is 90. Letter D. Okay? Kahit na yung manual add po ninyo, 16 plus 17 plus 18 plus 9 plus 20, ang result pa rin po is 90. So, 90 pa rin po yung, yung result. Okay? So, the correct answer here is letter D. Problem number 2, if 6 plus 7 plus 8 plus 9 plus 10 equals 40, which is parehas pa rin kanina, then 18 plus 19 plus 20 plus 21 plus 22 equals to blank. Okay. So, ang technique dito, class, pansinin natin yung increase, digit by digit. Okay. 6 at 18, ang difference nila is 12. 7 at 19, difference nila still 12. 8 at 20, that is 12. 9 and 21, difference nila is 12. 10 and 22, is difference nila is 12. So, therefore, limang 12. So, that is 12 plus 12 plus 12 plus 12 plus 12, or 12 times 5, that is 60. Then, 60 plus 40, para makuha natin yung 18 plus 19 plus 20 plus 21 plus 22, anong sagot? That is 100 po yan. 60 plus 40. Okay? So, ayan. 60 plus 40 or 40 plus 60, that is letter B. That is 100. Problem number 3. What is the percent of 96? What is the percent of 96 is 20% of 60. So, common na tinuturo before na when we encounter is, when we encounter is, is that is equal. Okay, yan yung common na tinuturo. So, what is the percent? The percent na tinatanong ng 96, that is, ilet natin as x. So, in equation, ganito po siya. Okay, 96x, 96x, that is x as percent, equals to 20% of 60. Equals dahil sa word na na is. Okay? So, 96x equals to 0.2 kasi in decimal form ng 20% is, ayan, i-move mo to the left dalawa. 1, 2. Kaya naging 0 0.20. Okay, paano nga yun? Para maging decimal, galing dito yung point. So, move ka dalawa. 1, 2. So, kaya naging 0 0.20 na siya. Okay, 0 0.20 na siya. So, yun. Yan, 96x, and we know that 20% of 60, that is 12, and then x is 12 over 96, and 12 divided by 96, that is 0 0.125. Now, take note that is still in decimal form, hindi po siya percentage form, we multiply natin ng 100 para maging, maging percentage, that is 12.5%, that is letter, letter C. Okay, so I hope klaro po yung solution ko, and if may tanong, Pwede nyo po akong i-message lang po sa messenger. Okay, so ito po, uh, I hope klaro po again yung solution ko dito for problem number 3. Okay? 
Okay, thank you for watching and do not forget to click subscribe and share also to others. So, bakit tayo mag-click ng subscribe? Para every time na mag-a-add ako ng new videos, ma-update po kayo or ma-notify po kayo ni YouTube na meron akong new videos na in-upload. Bakit natin kailangan i-share? Para naman makatulong tayo sa iba na lalo na yung mga taong nahihirapan sa mathematics questions. Okay? So, mga taong nahihirapan sa mathematics questions. So, ganun lang. Huwag mahihiyang magtanong. Hanapin niyo po ako sa Facebook or sa Messenger. And then, screenshot niyo lang yung specific na tanong niyo sa mga diniscuss po. Again, our next topic is Mathematics Practically Asked Questions in Civil Service Exam Part 13. Thank you, thank you, and have a nice day.